guys, Angie Mama Badger here, Badger's Business Solutions. And um, I had a client reach out to me and want to know how to do a refund on a transaction. So I'm helping out. Um, I'm, back, I'm logged into the back office. I have put in my credentials, username and password. I am now on the home tab. Um, I'll kind of circle it around so you can see. So when you open it up, you're going to immediately be brought to this page. So this is a transaction that we're searching for and that we're going to be refunding. So up here is the tab, um, transaction search. You're going to click on it. As you can see, there are different uh, options you can filter by, uh, dates, card and bank account information. If you have customer's name, which I always advise if you're going to do any transactions virtually and you're not swiping, make sure and put a first and last name for this reason so you can filter and find them later if you need to do a refund. And all you do is hit search when you're done. So in this particular case, um, it was a transaction done on August 14th. So I'm going to go in, choose my to and from, and I'm going to hit search at the bottom. Here's the transaction. So I can see and verify that, yes, this is the correct transaction that I need to refund. These transaction IDs are clickable. Just click on the transaction ID and this little pop-up window is going to come up. Okay. So then I'm going to hit refund. And I hit refund. Now it's brought up a little pop-up box. Okay. So click OK to continue this action and refund this transaction. Click cancel to abort this action and return to the previous page. So once it's just confirming that this is it, if it was a different refund amount, this is where I can specify. Uh, and then any details and things that are in it, email transaction receipt to customer if email provided, which in this case, this email was provided. So I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. And it's going to say it's successfully accepted. If this was declined, obviously it didn't go through. I'm going to hit close. And there you go. 